third, the last touchdown to Wilson, mm -hmm. the play before you get blasted pretty good, carrying out the fake. Just mm -hmm. how much satisfaction did you get out of the, the next play, making almost a perfect pass on that uh, that ball over the top to Wilson? I mean, we, we do so much work in practice. That was just a routine play for us. So uh, I, I like the, the uh, mismatch on Garrett, and I, and I thought uh, he was way better than the corner that was on him. So uh, I just went up to Garrett, and just, <laughs> just, it just happened like the practice, bro. So. Uh, really, really nothing. That was just a routine play. So left, uh, Austin. Justin, how would you describe the I don't know, confidence or mindset of this team right now? Uh, I think we're very confident right now. Right now. I mean, we came into Lincoln. Uh, the crowd was, was amazing here. They're, they have amazing fans. And uh, we, we had to play with, with I guess, a, a big crowd. And uh, they were loud at, at, at the beginning, at least. But I, I think we handled it well. And, and we just came out and uh, just, just jumped on them early and uh, didn't let up. So, so I think we did a good job. As loud as they were, how does it feel to you know, silence on the way you did. Um, it, was still, it feels great. I think the uh, offense did a great job. O-line did a great job. And um, defense definitely did a great job. So uh, I, I think we played well on both sides of the ball. So what, Doug? Justin, how would you describe what your running ability does for this offense, and in particular the first touchdown when you didn't seem to have anybody open and you run 15 yards? What did you see on that play? I just saw um, really the, the tight end. Uh, so, so that was a reach of tight end. So uh, I just saw uh, tight end wasn't open. I looked at JK, he wasn't open, so I just took down the run. And then, the, I mean, the lane was wide open, so uh, uh, I mean, I just, just did what, what I'm used to and just ran the ball, really. And that, that element, though, for, for this offense, that even when a team plays good coverage and takes your guys away, mm -hmm. that you can do that, what do you think that does to an opposing defense? Uh, it definitely uh, causes, causes the defense more stress, so uh, I feel like uh, the defense has to pay attention to me, JK, and then the passing game, so it definitely causes them more stress, and uh, I think we'll just, just keep getting better as the season goes on. Bill? Justin, you and, and your team is making it look easy. Does it feel that way on the field? Do you feel like you can do what you want whenever you want on Austin? I mean, it, it definitely feels easy going out there and playing, uh, and I, I think that just goes into practice. I mean, we practice hard uh, every day, especially Tuesdays and Wednesdays. So I think the, the harder we practice, the, the easier the game will be. A couple more, Clay. Yeah, Justin, the, the word statement's always kind of overused in, in sports, but uh, what kind of message did you send uh, kind of in prime time to the rest of the country tonight? Uh, I mean, they, they, they saw what was going on, on out there, so uh, I just, just felt like uh, our, our defense did a great job, as I said before, and then the offense did a tremendous job, the O-line did a tremendous job and also the coaches with the, with the play calling and uh, everything like that. So I think we were kind of click, clicking on all the cylinders today. Two more with we'll Dan. Justin, I know you guys try to take it week to week, but when you are playing as well as you have so far this season, is it hard not to think ahead about what the possibilities could be for this team? Uh, no, not really. I mean, we try to keep it week to week because in the recent years, as we all know, we've definitely slipped up in the, in the past. So uh, we're, we're definitely not doing that again this year. So we're just going to try to focus on uh, game by game and just, just take one, one game at a time. Sure. Hey, Justin, when you talk about going into the game, what was the? did you all think you'd be able to establish the run the way that you did with 230 rush yards in the first half? Mm -hmm. did, was that a part of the plan, or did that just materialize through the game? I mean, our, our O line is great. Uh, Coach Stead does a great job with those guys, so uh, it definitely wasn't surprising to see. And um, I just think the running backs, J.K. and Master, and Marcus at the end did a great job for running the ball down the throws. And I just just think physical with them. So I mean, it, it wasn't really surprising to see for, for me at least. Two more, all right. Justin, this is uh, you off to a fast start this year, but this is the first time you're playing on a on the road in a very hostile environment the way you were. This could be a time for a sophomore making his first, you know start on the road like this to, to stumble what was your you know temperament coming into this game and how quickly did it uh, I, I felt kind of calm and uh, confidence coming into this game so um, uh, I, I think that just goes with uh, preparation so so if you prepare hard I mean you have no, nothing to be worried about in the game and uh, just just really just go back to I guess the training so coach talks about uh, coach talks about that all the time but uh, we, we all get on the field we just go back to training and uh, I think we train really hard so I okay. definitely think that think it's, that makes the game easier. The last one, Dennis. Justin, when you got to Ohio State, when did you realize you could do these type of things in this offense? Uh, I mean, Coach Day told me right from the get-go. I mean, uh, and, and so did Dwayne. I mean, uh, this is offense is a great offense, and I feel like it fits as well. Uh, we have a great passing game, a great running game, and I think the offense is just, just great on really, really all, all things. Really, so. Thank you, Justin.